English Wiggle Boy checking in YouTube world with another series to this video. So you wanna own an English Bulldog. Well, we got bamboo chops there. She's looking real comfortable. The last four feedings didn't go like this. She had to be restrained by my legs and arms just so she can stand lay there so they can eat. And all four times, she sat up there and interrupted their feeding so they didn't get as much as they wanted to. And it also helps that she took her medicine this morning, which is probably just kicked in because I let her eat medicine, poop and pee. She tried to figure out, hey, I'm doing this on my own. Muy bien. Muy bien. We're working on day two. Actually, it's day three, but we haven't made 72 hours yet. About four o'clock, it'll be 72 hours, which will be officially three days for these little jokers. Two boys we have. And I feel they're doing all right. First time English Bulldog breeder. First time actually whelping a litter. It's a lot different with pit bulls. Hey, they had a babies. They do what they do. And however many come out walking after mom does her thing with them for them couple weeks, that's what we had to go with. Natural. One may be sick, mom don't want it. She rejects it. Yeah, we can intervene as humans. But some breeds, mom has 10, 12 dogs sometimes, more. Just depends on how big she is. But when we having these big litters with these designer dogs, you want to intervene as much as possible. Some of us breeders having full-time jobs because this isn't a career, more like a hobby, more like a side entrepreneurship. Gotta have full-time jobs or some type of income coming in. You gotta pay for the stud fee. Let me back up, you gotta pay for tests. Well, I was right, stud fee, then pay for tests once you come in heat. But progesterone levels. After that, whether AI, surgical or natural tie, which with these dogs, they don't do natural tie with the English Bulldogs, but you gotta pay for those services. After y'all pay for those services, then you got to do another progesterone, but this time it's a reverse progesterone. Same thing, just looking at the numbers different. And when all that is good to go, then you pay for your C-section, because they don't have natural births, just like they don't do natural ties. C-section. Then here's where more of the journey begins. She got a little bit in here, just so it can fit in the weapon box. But they stay in the incubator over there while I sleep right there. So yeah, I just wanted to check in with y'all, let y'all see we almost on day three. They gaining weight a little bit. They doing 
doing what they're supposed to do. Mm-hmm. They lost the first 24 hours away. Now they starting the game 24 hours away. All right. We'll check in with y'all in the next couple days. Make day seven. After that week, y'all know we on the home stretch. All right, YouTube real. Bamboo chops. And the little choppers. Sign up.